You know you're a banjo kazooie man if you got a couch in front of your front yard <laughs> with a CTRT CRT TV hooked up to NASCAR 96 on the N63, <laughs> bought by bootleggers in South Carolina. Man, I had an N34. <laughs> <laughs> now that's a rule 34 if you catch my dick. How many wheels your truck got? <laughs> Answer me this, old timer. <laughs> 32 wheels. Because <laughs> I got two. 32 wheels. Yep, I just duct I just duct taped two 18 wheelers together. You're speaking my language, son. <laughs> I take my daughter daughter to school every day with my thirteen thousand wheeler. <laughs> she is so proud of me. She's got the whole school. She is so popular because she comes out of an eighteen thousand wheeler every day. <laughs> I love my twenty four thousand wheeler so much. I'm I'm putting more wheels on as we speak. <laughs> <laughs> no, how <laughs> thirty two thousand wheelers the best goddamn thing has ever happened. Now how I'm many gonna... miles per gallon does that cost? Because as a true Terry maid, mine only gets point five miles per gallon. <laughs> now just between you and me, I don't pay taxes. <laughs> I don't go by the rules. I live in my little bungalow in uh, way up in the mountains. <laughs> the in mountains? Texas. Yep. Really big mountain. It's called Spiral Mountain. <laughs> but I done just thought you said you went up to Spiral Mountain. I did. I saw a witch and I never came back. So how do you live there? <laughs> I just don't have a choice in that, do I? <laughs> yep, I'm just on my lazy boy chair. I'm just playing Smash Borders as a banjo kazooie man. <laughs> Something funny, boy? Oh, yes, there is. <laughs> <laughs> you ever tried the new dip? The what? This came out the Copenhagen mint. No. It's a bag of dip. <laughs> I just uh, I just packed myself a fat fat lip of some mighty dip. <laughs> Now, John, all I do is <laughs> all I do is make moonshine. <laughs> Luigi is walking on my keyboard. <laughs> I'm gonna send you what he sent. Luigi. Okay, he's gone. Did I lose a stock because of you? Hell yeah, Morther. Now, I don't know what these people are doing here on this here fighting arena. I mean, per, to no, try... They're just sitting there. That that, that red-haired one is just looking in the distance there like he's going to blow the place <laughs> to, to, tell you, to tell you the truth, I'm not real fond of immigrants. <laughs> tell you the truth, I don't like immigrants at all. I think we should just get rid of them and zap them all with our big lasers. Like, well, come on, Trump. I voted for you for a reason. Blast away! <laughs> I don't agree with any of this treachery. <laughs> I did not vote for Trump. This is what Trump wants. He just wants to build a giant Death Star and laser all the immigrants. <laughs> <laughs> did you see the video of the kid? You ever seen the video of the kid? It was on a donkey video, I think. <laughs> where, where someone asks a kid, why do you want Trump, why do you want to vote for, <laughs> vote, Blah. Can you talk, you can you why, talk why do you want right? Trump to win the election? <laughs> what? What do you say? <laughs> the kid said, said something like, um, 
He's gonna get all the immig imm immigrants out. <laughs> he, he like stuttered for something. <laughs> oh my god, I, I I completely forgot the video. But I bet he didn't it made know what immigrants so mean. Hard. Why would they ask children about politics? That's so bad. <laughs> I don't know, but I just hit your banjo in the clip. <laughs> Do you think banjo's a Trump supporter? Definitely. <laughs> 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 Obviously, he. Now, I would never vote for Bernie in my whole life. I swear to God, that geezer's gonna die any second now. Obviously. He's probably gonna die the day of the election. Obviously, Banjo ran um, an immigrant witch out of her own home. He's, he's just gonna say something like, "Oh, I don't feel so good," and then he's gonna fade away. <laughs> I don't feel so good. <laughs> <laughs> My Bernie impression's so bad. I don't even know what he. I don't even know what he sounds like. <laughs> I know. Well, he, I know he's old. He probably has diapers and is decrepit. Sounds like a. Probably. Like a freaking, probably he has a small like case of Jersey. Alzheimer's. <laughs> Where is he from? Alexa, where's Bernie Sanders from? <laughs> He's born in Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> Where was Trump born? New York City. Of course he was. <laughs> Freaking dirty ass orange man. Don't say things about the president like that. He's gonna get you. <laughs> he, He's gonna get you he is with being his he, little hands. He is being impeached, sir. <laughs> what if you saw a tiny little orange hand grab your? <laughs> 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 it was just covered in Cheeto dust. <laughs> <laughs> I am a real gamer. Now what the hell is Cheeto Cheetah doing in my apartment? <laughs> <laughs> now what the hell? Who is more southern, Terry Bogard or Banjo Kazooie? Obviously Terry. Do you see the outfit yeah. he's wearing? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he was wanted in South America. <laughs> <laughs> he is so south. His mother is his daughter. <laughs> <laughs> That's how south he is, Border. <laughs> no, you're Terry Bogard, Maine, when you got it. <laughs> I don't even want to say that. It's soft. <laughs> Yo, did you see the... The the Shrek is love, Shrek is life thing I put when you say you guys? I don't like it. <laughs> of course you don't. <laughs> I don't like it one bit. Sir. It's hilarious. I don't like it. <laughs> it's, it's so funny. <laughs> Bruh. Someone thought that was a good idea. What? Shrek is love. <laughs> It wasn't an idea, it's a religion. <laughs> oh yes, the religion. <laughs> Someone thought it was a good idea to found that religion. Now, I don't know about you and me, but that's a religion I can get behind. No, I'm Ooh, not okay. I read that rule so bad. You freaking suck, Marcus. <laughs> Owie. And Joey is daddy. Freaking oh, hey John. Yes. Who are you gonna vote for th for the Olympics? <laughs> the Olympics. Yeah, dude. I'm not registered to vote. Because <laughs> <laughs> because you're an immigrant. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Freaking live in Rhode Island. Rhode Islanders can't vote. An immigrant, an immigrant born in South Carolina. Freaking Marcus. I was born in a shitty place called Rhode Island. 
<laughs> so why do you have a southern accent? Because <laughs> that's how south I am. I, I, dig, I dug myself deep. I went to Florida. <laughs> that's still. And I decided there's just too many Cubans here, so I went up to Georgia. <laughs> and I just said, "There's Austin here," so I went up to North Carolina. I just didn't even want any part of South Carolina because you were there. <laughs> <laughs> and then Luigi was in North Carolina, so I left, went up to <laughs> then West Virginia, and then Kentucky, and then I went up and I just jumped really high and I went to Russia. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> Do you remember? You never played Reich. <laughs> nah, as a true as a Richter. true Richter main, I really <laughs> like <laughs> I really like whips. <laughs> I really like to use my whip in the bedroom and in the smash arena at the same time. <laughs> if you whip your workers, it gets them it gets them to do their job quite well. <laughs> I should know. <laughs> You should know as a Richter main. Yep. <laughs> now, what's your, what's your best quality, Richter main? My whip. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I see. I see. Now, you got anything <laughs> else other than your whip, now, son? <laughs> well, as you can see, I have the same ripped shirt as Terry, so you know I beat my wife. Well, my alt is literally a wife beater shirt, so I beat my wife even harder than your wife. <laughs> I beat my wife right now, just to prove how much I beat my wife. Well, I should hope so. You people in the South uh, uh, compete. I should hope so, Border. I mean, you need, you need to discipline your younger sister. <laughs> Sister? You mean my wife? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the stream is this a stream or <laughs> no it's no it's a recording. <laughs> okay. I don't have the balls to stream this. This is the worst, if, this is the worst stream ever. <laughs> Now this here whip, I got it from my great grandpappy. <laughs> Your great grandpappy. Yep. Yeah, yeah, you, you could probably guess his. You could probably guess his job. It's pretty self-explanatory. He did own a huge farm. <laughs> now, now Dev won't like me saying this, but my. <laughs> 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 the, this farm right here that I'm talking about that my great grandpappy owned <laughs> it wasn't your ordinary farm <laughs> now for for liability reasons I need not say what it was <laughs> Well, ever since this, ever, ever since this so-called president, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure his name was Abraham. <laughs> this that farm has gone downhill. It's it's part of the, one of those history museums in d down in the oh. south. History museums, those bigoted racist <laughs> history museums that poke fun at our flag of nations. 